he, um, so I'm at work mopping and I'm thinking to myself, you know, I really need an accountability partner or a couple of them. Um, I would like somebody who can be, well, can help me be accountable financially and with my fitness and diet and maybe my hobbies. Um, yeah, I, I, I found that um, since I got out of the military, like my brain wasn't in a good spot. Um, everybody, like there was a little group of people that I hung out with, but there was like a lot of girl on girl drama and I didn't know how to cope with it. And you add in the fact that I had <laughs> just gotten out of the military and like everybody was friendly with each other and everybody was on the same side. And all of a sudden there were like these little clicks peeling off of the group. Yeah, it was, it was no good. So I found myself just, I, I mean, I've been out of the military since beginning of 2009 and I just have not had, um, like I had a group of friends and I've had random friends and there's people that I hang out with when I go out to the bar or there's people that I, um, like I can go places and not, not be alone, but at the same time, like I don't have anybody that I can bounce everything that's going on in my head or um, that I feel comfortable asking for help. Cause I, I, um, I don't wanna burden people. Uh, I live in a, a pretty liberal area which it's weird because it's a really conservative or really liberal. It's, there's not a whole lot of middle of the road. Um, so when it comes to my, my military stuff, uh, it's pretty intense for a lot of people. And then when it comes to a lot of everything else, like especially my politics is pretty liberal. Um, and I can't really talk to people about that either because everybody's like way more liberal than me or way more conservative than me. So I just, I don't know, I just haven't been able to um, find anybody that I really mesh with um, that I can talk about anything with and not have to worry about burdening them. So anyway, so this is kind of a, a call out. I'm looking for accountability partner. Um, Financial accountability, fitness accountability, primarily. Um, perhaps um, somebody who's into meal prepping, food budgeting. I mean, that comes kind of back to finances. Um, yeah, that would be really awesome. Um, we can talk about whatever. I'm pretty open, um, so long as you don't hate on any group of humans or animals, because I like pit bulls and they seem to get a bad rap. Um, yeah, so if you're, if you're cool with people and you're cool with animals and you're cool with, you know, the world is ours to take care of and not necessarily to use up, but at the same time, I like cars. So like, obviously I'm not a full-fledged liberal. <laughs> Um, so yeah, if, if you think that you're, uh, moderate or capable of being open-minded to some things, um, that would be optimal, but it could just all be about finance or all about food or all about fitness. Um, yeah, we'll sort that out as things go by. But anyway, accountability partner call out. Anybody want to help me? I'm really cool and sometimes funny. Sometimes. Mostly just dad jokes. <laughs> All right. Thanks anybody who watches this. And check in and see if there's anybody that is in your life that needs an accountability partner or maybe somebody in your life that you can check in with. Um, make sure that they're eating well and that they're getting out on their walks and things like that. Because... We're on this planet together. We might as well help each other take care of each other. All right.
Peace out. <laughs> Bye.